Hey guys, this is Bharat and welcome to Bharat's Kitchen with chili chicken and cheese pockets. This is a very simple and easy snack recipe to make. So what are we waiting for? Let's begin with it. So first we're going to need to roughly chop some capsicum, some carrots and loads of ginger. We also going to need some spring onions and some chopped onions. Now for the spicy sauce, I'm going to take some water, lots of green chili sauce as it is chili chicken. We also going to add some acidity in the form of vinegar. Then comes some soy sauce, some oyster sauce, and last but not the least, some cornstarch to thicken the gravy. That's it. Just mix everything together and your sauce mix is ready. Moving on, you need to finely chop the chicken, and yes, you can use chicken mince here as well, but I prefer those chunky chicken bits. That is why I'm chopping it. All right, time to cook. So we're gonna take a pan and keep it on a high flame. To this, add some oil, chopped onions, and the spring onions. Now you don't need to sear the vegetables. You need to sweat them. That is, you. Don't need to brown the vegetables, but you need to cook them until they are translucent. So cook for about a minute or so, and then add the ginger and the carrots. Then again cook for about two minutes more, and in the meanwhile keep stirring. Now add the capsicum, and again cook for about a minute. And at this point comes in our chicken and cook it until it becomes a little white. And when that happens, add your sauce mix, some salt, some black pepper, and cook until the sauce is reduced. Last but not the least, you can add some dried parsley. Or some fresh coriander leaves, and that's it. Your stuffing is ready. Now, since I told you it is an easy recipe, you don't need to knead a dough or work on any sort of pastry. You just need few bread slices to make the shell of the pockets, and it can be any bread, whole wheat or white bread. Just remove the corners and make sure that you're using a fresh bread here. Otherwise, you won't be able to roll it properly. Now, with the help of a rolling pin, make the bread as flat as you can. And divide this flat bread into halves. Now, for binding, you're gonna need an egg with some milk. And make sure you whisk the egg and milk properly. And to make the final coating, you're gonna need some bread crumbs. All right, time to assemble. So on the edges, apply some egg wash. And then add a little bit of that chili chicken stuffing and some mozzarella cheese. Gently close the edges. And if you get these little holes, while closing the pockets then don't worry the egg wash and the bread crumbs will take care of it just make sure it isn't a big hole so first dip the pocket in the egg wash and then in the bread crumbs now you can store these pockets for about 2 days in a freezer inside an airtight container or you can fry them on a medium low flame for about 5 minutes or until they are golden brown and if you want to bake them then you can bake them at 200 degrees celsius for about 10 to 15 minutes in a preheated oven and then you'll get this yeah 
I really like this dish because it's spicy and it's cheesy all at the same time. But there you are guys, how to make chili chicken and cheese pockets. And as always, you'll find all the list of ingredients and their measurements on my website. And if you like this video, do give it a thumbs up. Until then, I'll see you all next time.